I got lots of bubbles today. Hi, I'm Jamie Black, your bathtub philosopher. Well, it is Sunday after Thanksgiving. I think a lot of stuff going on last week. You know, Charles Manson died, Della Reese died, David Cassidy died. I think I love you, so what am I so afraid of? I'm afraid that I'm not sure of a love there is no cure for. Um, yeah, so there's a lot of things that happened last week. But um, Thanksgiving weekend, there's a lot of people out Thanksgiving weekend. And one of the people that are out a lot, but not just Thanksgiving weekend, but like all the time, are those uh, bucket drummers. You know, the kids that are out on the street with the buckets and the drumsticks and the drumming and the, you know, banging on them and everything like that. And I, I was like, you know, I was just thinking, you know, they need to step up their game because this bucket drumming now is getting a little old. Let's get a little tired. You know what I'm saying? They need to do, they need to step up their game. Because let me tell you something. There is a uh, band that plays at the corner of 99th Street and Halstead. It's a band. They have a bass drum. They have a snare drum. They have a cymbal player. And they have a trumpet player. And, I mean, they have a whole band. Now, these guys are doing something. You got to step up your game. Now, I said this a few years ago because the homeless population had to start stepping up their game when that one dude, remember that homeless dude a long time ago, that uh, the one with the, with the smooth radio voice and, you know, his, his uh, video went viral and then Dr. Phil tried to save him because he's an alcoholic and a drug addict and everything like that. You know, when, when the homeless people saw this guy got off the street and then started getting all this money, they were like, we got to step up our game. And I said, that's what I said. You got to step up your game. You got to do something. You got to learn how to tap dance or, you know, sing a song or something like that. You just can't be standing on the street corner with a sign that says, help me, I need some money, give me some money. That ain't gonna work no more. You have to step up your game. Although, they have uh, started using laminated signs. So that is a step in the right direction because, you know, you got a laminated sign, you look professional. You look like a professional homeless person. So, uh, you know, I, I think... It, you know, gives you some street cred. Makes you more legit. Also lately, people have been writing their whole life story on the cardboard. Uh, so, you know, and I ain't got time. I mean, the red light ain't long enough for me to read your entire life story, you know, and, 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 and to pull on my heartstrings so that I will give you some money. You know, just cut to the chase. Are you hungry? Are you thirsty? Do you need a fix? Just say what you need. Ask for that. Just be honest about what it is you need. And also come, come with some kind of a skill that you can do. You know, to entertain the people. To make them want to reach into their pockets and give you some money. That's my friendly tip to you for the holidays. I hope you have a happy holiday season this year. Go out and do something good for somebody. Because there's so much bad shit happening right now. We got to counteract it with some good. So go out and then do some good for somebody. I'm Jamie Black, your bathtub philosopher. <laughs> oh, yeah, lots of bubbles. Mm. Lots and lots of bubbles. Oh, yes. <sighs> this feels so damn good. Hello? Hello? Yeah. You yes, I know. I purposely oh. forgot it. I really didn't need any. Okay, all right. That's all. Talk oh. to you later. Okay. Okay, bye. Bye, I love you. Love you too. Bye.